Okay, first base basically is a anti-free base. We can see from the town hall and you know the the base. The first thing I see on this base is this this multi. This multi compartment looks like little bit little bit weak. I think like the Buddha also like put a, like the the Tesla farm here to avoid like maybe King and RC Sui. Another mistake I see on this base is maybe this scatter shot is is pretty easily to take maybe by one here only is uh, it's kind of weak on this this compartment. Also eagle, maybe there's a possible flame flinger from this side since the mortal cover only this side. So let's go and see like how we can fix it. Another thing is from here near the CC. If we can see like from the CC, we can get like this multi from the from the town hall compartment is another mistake we, we have to fix. So let's jump on it and, and fix this base. Okay, first thing for make this multi doesn't reachable from the town hall. We just need like do a simple step like this. But we we will remove like all the traps to like to fix it like more quickly. I think I removed everything. Perfect. So basically, for make this multi not reachable, we just like do something like this. And we check also this single is not reachable. Yeah, perfect. So basically now single can't be reached from the multi and the multi can't be reached from the single. So it's already like a small change but sometimes can make the difference on the basis. Another thing is is we, we try to save some walls because we need like walls for this multi compartment. So we always try to save walls. So what we can do, we can do like something creative here, like do like a channel, like go going on this way. So, okay, like this and like this. In this way, we save it like one walls. We can save more walls from here. Okay, another important thing is when when he's building a base, he's always try to use the walls like in the best way as possible at the beginning. If you like use the walls correctly, your base will be like at another level. So let's do something like this. Scatter more inside the base so it's harder to reach for maybe the heroes. In this case, we also have extra walls from the multi. We can do something like this. Okay. So basically, we saved seven walls from, from this compartment. Another thing we can do is like move this like one time more in up and do something like this to make the wall breaker harder. We can put the sweeper here and maybe one storage here. Perfect. We can move everything like this. If me, I would put like RC here to make it like a little bit more harder to to the sui we can put again the mortal the air defense like like before okay cannon okay basically we, we save it like like some walls another part of the village we can save walls i think is here is in this compartment we can save these walls let me check it now we can remove this 
Yep, so this base was built by Atri, who's actually in the chat right now. Welcome in, man. So End is currently reviewing your base. Thank you so much for submitting it through our Discord. You, of course, will uh, will win one of those Blueprint gift cards. So GG's to you, man. But uh, yeah, some really good advice coming in so far. But if you guys do have any questions or anything, make sure you let us know in that chat. Um, I'm sure End will be more than happy to answer those. Yeah, basically, we try now to, to save walls from these bases. Like... Because we, as we said like before, we needed like the walls for that that multi to to make it like more strong. Because as you know, like multi scatter shot, those defense are pretty pretty important. So I move all the bases one time more in the, more in down. So we have like more space here. Okay. So now we have a lot of walls saved from the compartment you can also close here and make make this like a little bit longer another thing we can see on this base is maybe a possible safe blimp safe blimp can come from here because there's no storage it's important to always maybe have like like storage on here on or on here also the outside trash is important we can put like some resources to like to stop the goblin fears because the army camp the goblin will just go on here then go directly inside so we we better like put some the trash also is important on the base so we put this type of trash outside the base for against the super goblin of course like we said here maybe is 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 better like i said su one suggestion i can give is on the town hall. I always suggest like the multi mortar because I think it's stronger as, against like the flame flinger. So we try to see see like okay, the storage is nice here. So we already making like the the super blimp, you know, with the super goblin, little bit like like scary to do, or or maybe they will give like more attention to use maybe more loons or scout better. We can put like archer tower here. Okay. We can put again a bomb tower here. And yeah. Another thing we can do is finally close this compartment. Let me see how we can do it. We can do it like this. This channel is okay. We can close it now. like this so we basically fixed this multi another thing we said is the flame finger there i suggest like the, the mortar maybe like little bit more in up sometimes even in the angle it is good we can put maybe archer tower here or or here like this king is good always on the eagle because it has like protect your ego from any sweep and make it like slower so it's nice this another thing we can we can see is maybe there's two cannon maybe one is is enough we can like add a cannon here cannon here are different another thing i i see often is the the with tower near the art defense i think it's not a good combination because when when people will just do lava loon, they will like send the lava hound, and the wizard tower always targeted the lava and didn't target the loons. So a, a trick, a good trick we can do is like put far from the wizard tower, something like this. Okay, the air the air defense. This one is not needed. Okay, like this. This we can put here. Here we already have the mortar. Here is okay. This we can put here. In the last air defense we can put here. I think here is better. Okay. Mortar. Yeah, basically the base is, is, uh, is more fixed. But we can see another thing on this base is the zap value. Here, I think 
we are giving like a good zap value. Like X bow, scatter shot, and queen is a good zap value. Also here maybe Ntanghu is nice. So so we try fix like the queen compartment to give like maybe like less zap value. So the wording is, is here is nice. So we just put maybe the X bone here, put it to ground. We, we we look the base and we try to look like where is weak to the damages. So here maybe we can do something like this. Mm. The X bow here. Okay. This I think an X bow here is nice because it covers this scatter shot. Another X bow, maybe we can put another X bow, I think is nice. Is nice here maybe in this in this compartment in the eagle near the eagle. <laughs> so we can do something like this. Make it a little bit bigger here. So we make a, a space. Of course we are making the multi-compartment breakable now. But we still have like this multi cover like if we go here we'll we'll burn your healers so it's fine here. We can make this this one is fine. We can make it longer this one. Okay, basically the base is is pretty much fixed. We try to not give like holes. Okay. And now and now is the base is already looking like like more stronger. So so next step we we trying to to replace maybe some something like like the warden the warden I as I said is nice near the queen. We can put here it covers the queen. The last style defense we can put on the eagle because we have already. We can put here. Here maybe need a cannon. Which cannon we can take? This one we can't. Mm. I think this one is is okay. So yeah. We we distance the, the trash building like the army camp. We can put like like here. We can make it is bigger. I usually recommend like elixir drill under a, a, a structure because in case of of bowlers, you know the bounce. We can fix the trash here. Here we can do as web army camp here here we put the rest of the trash now okay storage. We have another storage we can put here. And we need another storage there. Let me check where I can. Okay. Basically, this is the fix on the base. We basically put it everything. You can put like maybe two Buddha hut there. One and two. And 
last building. Let me see. We can put here. Okay. But after we we put uh, like everything, we try to look if there's like a weakness like this. Okay, let's zoom out. Like like watch the base. One thing I see on this base is this air defense is pretty free to super loons. So what we can do, we can like maybe put like a cannon here to, to avoid this. Another thing, let me see where is where is weak. I think the rest is okay on this base. Okay. Maybe we need like more HP. More HP here. Okay. Basically is is this the base. So now what what we see on this base? We can possibly see like like as we some something like on this cutter. So we try to bait this cutter shot. We can put this So okay, we maybe put like one spring traps here, maybe like to to try defend like some ice golem here. It's nice. And we I think we, we can put like the Tesla farm here. One here. One here and, and one here. Giant bomb, skeleton, skeleton, and it's okay. Another thing we can see is maybe dragon's hit. Dragon's hit will pretty sure come from here, like this, in this way. Maybe here outside, go inside the eagle. And RC maybe end back. So this Tesla outside for any Sui hero is good also against the RC for the end back. So for fix this, I think we need put like the better better high sweeper here. So we can like point in here. I think it's still same because people will just zap it. But still people have to, to waste more spell. At least to to maybe play the super dragons. But we still, we, we try to draft like where the blimp will come. Maybe the blimp will come from here or something like this. So we need to bait this, this entry. So bait the blimp. Nado and red bombs here because we spin, open the blimp and, and kill like the blimp, something from the from the blimp. Another thing we can do here, maybe Queen more deep is better here. Okay. Another thing we can do is look the loons puffing. When we play Super Dragon, it's always nice to look the, the loons puffing. So the first drop, the loons will follow this way. So we need make sure to put like in these two compartments the black bombs more deep so we can also take these two tesla it's nice and put the black bombs here also red bombs and some skelly at the end back here one black here, and two black bomb here at the end. What's your preference with the ground or air skeletons here? Mm hmm. I okay. Basically, ground skeleton is uh, is most used against maybe the the sweet hero. You know, I like to use sometimes the the ice skelly. Make maybe sometimes people will just do fire side. I like do maybe put like one here. On, only for make the dragons go on this way, you know. I, I now I put it here to to like, you know, to make the dragon like slow down a bit. But I think against the dragon you need pretty sure bait the hero. 
the hero is is the most uh, strong if you beat the hero then you you will defend it because baiting the dragons i think is is not worth it all you need is bait the hero so here perfect this one i think is better i because as we see like the ground bow didn't shoot like the outside hero so we can like put air against the dragons here this one is good is good also to to ground yeah this one is ground is fine because we hit maybe any queen charge here hybrid spring traps we can use in two ways first way is against the head hunters second way is against the ground troops like hybrid queen charge hogs stuff like that now of course we will put like against the hybrid because I, we think like is is more common so maybe queen charge the town hall and and a hybrid like one of of those scatter shot would come on or the on the queen or the rc depends but on this base let me check i think is 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 better i think it's better on the queen so what we do what we do here we put the, the spring traps so one here make this we put more near to make the spring better we put the giant bomb okay one another spring traps is good here one here one giant here is a nice spot as well yeah of course my traps like now is put uh, like like kind of basic you know of course when you know the enemy when you are testing you will put like different traps depends on the enemy how they hit you need put the traps no traps is better because as i say you need test it before use the base okay now we put and last giant bomb i think we can put here okay basically this is the first base we can take a look of this base now basically we made like the blimp bait here the tesla against the dragons with all the all the traps here we made like the the sui bait and maybe the spring against maybe the hybrid but we need to check like when we testing if it's better on the rc or on the queen depends like but this is the first base we 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 can jump on on the second base now this one okay <clears throat> this one okay this one same problem as uh, as before base as we see on this base there's a problem here these two side is is easy to super goblin blimp so we need to fix it another thing maybe i can just queen charge here break here and the queen will keep going king here because this wall is open it's too nice for the queen charge so i think in my opinion it's better close these walls to 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 make this attack at least harder so let's jump jump on on it and let's fix it okay as we said like here is weak to, to the blimp we i'm not saying the people will do it because if we put storage people still can do it but at least they will be like more careful before do it so we can here one storage is enough we can put like one storage here it's already better i i remove the traps to Yep, so this, this base was uh, submitted through our Twitter uh, by Dark Soul. Uh, so I don't know if he's in the chat, but if you are, feel free to say hey. Uh, so you can uh, let us know if you've got any questions for End on your base that you built. If not, then we'll uh, we'll try and get this video up on YouTube after. So if you guys do miss it, you can catch all of End's tips and tricks over there on our YouTube channel.
yeah one thing i i have to say one thing i don't like is is this like like the building is uh is too close to each other these buildings like like here also why why when the, the building is is too close is not too good i'm saying because right now the meta is is pretty sure like like 50 percent everywhere you will see like maybe a dragon spam the dragon spam if you give like value like this it will just change like defense so so it's better for example we put something like this because the chain there's no chain so dragons maybe lose like one second more two seconds more to take the defense but maybe this will change your attack i mean so we just try to not give like chain value for the super dragons okay like here we can like see where we can save the walls okay this wall here is needed like we can save like one wall here in here so we can close the sweeper here is nice xbox here is nice we try to give like less time value here another thing we can see is the wall breaker here let me show you maybe this charge king and queen this wall breaker is nice for the queen go go like this and maybe we can drop the army here so we try to fix this entry so for for fix this entry what we need to do we need to save some walls okay this one we can remove We can get some walls from here. We can make it smaller. Here we can save another wall. Let me check where I can save another wall. I think here we can make it smaller. So remember, if any of you guys in chat do have any question, questions for end, make sure you let us know. Okay, basically I put a, like that zone here to make it like a little bit more hard to to break here. We can put like Buddha heart here. So now wall breaker will go on the on the R defense. Is is a little bit harder in my opinion like this. Of course, after the test maybe it's better on what depends. Another thing, wall break yes, Buddha heart we can put here okay bomb tower i think here could be nice here there's nothing shoot air so we need to put something here maybe the the archer tower here is nice here we already have the air defense is okay here we we try to avoid the, the chain another thing we we can see here is this ground expo can be heated from outside walls. We can do like a, a, a easy move. So like now it can be shooted from outside. Another thing we can do here. Here the chain is okay. We can do like this. This air defense is easy for super loons. what we do we put maybe like this here a good zap value maybe with with it which is nice also here yeah this base is is already looking very good in my opinion this buddha hut maybe i suggest like to remove to make the path may be like a little bit more interesting. This Buddha hut we can put here. Okay. Last with tower. Let's check where is weak against the splash damage. Where is weak? I think on the town hall is pretty weak. 
against this splash so we put here one and here another we put here the trash is is nice here So pretty much these bases are already looking nice. I don't see like others fix. Let's check X bow range. X bow range is, is kind of okay. Okay. What we need bait here? Let me check. Hmm. Tesla farm. Like on this cutter shot, I think it's good Tesla's. Maybe Chewy is enough here. Another good spot of Tesla, in my opinion, is here. We can put like one time more in down, so we can put also the Skelly. Two red bomb here. Here we put like against. Okay. Skeleton, Skeleton. Giant, we check like where ice spawn will come from. Maybe from from the back like this. There's a possible ice spawn from here, and and a possible blink on this way. So I think tornado on this point is nice. We can put tornado here. Perfect. Red bomb here, waiting the blimp coming. And the black bomb. Okay, another important trick against the dragons is, is like this. If people spam like this, and they drop the blimp here. We need to make sure on this compartment we don't put any black bomb because for the simple reason Warden plus the blimp will trigger all the black bomb in this compartment. So we need to make sure. So it's better maybe put more from here, you know, on this on this compartment because we know like the blimp won't trigger. So the blimp come from here. We can put put the black bomb from here. Like in this compartment. So let's put it. Okay. Another thing if you wanted to to see is let me check a possible Save blimp. Hmm. I think we will leave just like this. <laughs> Here, hybrid. Let me check, or we can use also against the head hunter. We can put the spring. I think here is nice. In here, giant bomb. We can put like one outside here. Let's put small bomb. We've got a question in chat just asking about uh, baiting the town hall for sneaky goblins. So I know you've already kind of covered it with storages. But there was, uh, they were just asking kind of mm -hmm. what, what bombs and stuff you would use to maybe bait out uh, the sneaky goblins going into the town hall. Okay, I will show like how to bait the, the super goblin on the town hall. Okay, so for bait this hit, we need to know like the goblins, how goblins will work. 
So basically, people will drop like one here and uh, and two to free here, two free here, and after this, we'll go directly here, right? So we need to 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 check this sequence. For bait the super goblin, we can do like a simple step like this. We can change by the storage here. Why we put in storage here? Because we have like an extra space here. So we can put like the bombs. Okay. Another thing, we can put this one tile more in down. One spring. And and take some spring here. Because after goblin we go here, we split. So people have to do to to drop again like three goblin two goblin you know the sequence and after we can put like the final step the giant bomb and the small bomb this is basically how to defend the super goblin we can also change this army camp maybe to do something like this to make it to make him waste like one more super goblin Basically, yeah, is, is like this how to fix. Another thing we can do is like check like where we have like an extra boulder hut to recover also this boulder hut because it's important. If we want to defend it, we need like something recover this. So super going go inside and we want like immediately something like repair the, it. So this is in range perfectly. It will recover this HP. So basically this is like to defend super goblins on the town hall is sneaky. But if they do blimp, I think they will take anyway the, the town hall. So if they blimp, you have a, like also to invest like black bomb, like more bombs for sure, or maybe maybe something something else. Yeah, basically this is the base. We jump off on the on the field base. And is this one. Okay, this base is already looking very nice a thing i can see immediately on this base is a this value yeti blimp value this yeti blimp take this compartment and also the cc lure and after he can do like many strategy after this blimp so we need try to fix this blimp so what we do to fix this CC, maybe we can just like put CC on here on the town hall. Like we say before, we don't give try to give like chain value like here, I defense and storage. It give like a, a very good chain value. So we, we need try to what we do. We remove here and we already removed the chain. Another thing we can do here is save the walls. We check like here the extra wall we can use maybe better. Here we can maybe open, open. They make the entry a little bit more hard. Okay, I think this this nado. Mm, I think it's easy to trigger. Maybe we can put like like an extra Tesla here. Like this to avoid maybe some blizzard here. Okay, this is okay. What we can, where we can save walls on this base? I think here we can remove to save walls. Here is okay. We can put like one time more in up, I think. Okay. Mm -hmm. This we can open. This builder hat, I think, is not needed here. This bomb tower is nice here. Okay. I think. Oh, I see the bait. Because I think. On this base, also Queen Charge on the Eagle. Basically, these red bombs is against the Queen Charge here. 
so we can put again the, the here to make the, the bit happens okay what we can fix it more remove this boulder hat this is on this way is is too much compact it's too compact we give like too much chain we try to make it less now okay we save it also some some buildings what we can do here is i think like maybe this muta is easy to break so maybe we can do like something more harder this with tower we can i think it's better outside outside of of that defense range because i think against the bats is better like this scatter and far with towers so they can't freeze together both together so it's better in my opinion here we can put a trash building here mortal mortar one mistake i i often see is people putting like mortars outside mortars have to be always inside the base never outside so we put inside like here here the six ball so here no flame finger so this one we can put here put here okay we swap it like before i think here is more nice to have this yeah the base is pretty looking already very nice like these two storage let me see where we can put maybe here so paul who submitted this base was saying he had that mortar over next to the town hall on the outside because he has the ground expo sitting next to the town hall so that would automatically target a flame flinger yeah 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 of course like this on this range you know like this range is impossible to drop the flame finger because but if if they come from here maybe tank it before doesn't have the the mortar maybe if they quake they still can get the 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 town hall anyway outside mortar is not needed so we put here at least you know to make it waste more troops because on as i said like in this compartment the the flame finger is is um you still can't can't take the the town hall so we just making like maybe flame finger on this base won't happen because there's two mortar you know it's not so so much common but we just making like it more sure you know like like preventing okay a flame finger a good value i think flame finger here is a very good value like like here like this compartment because after he will take like one two three four and and then he can start in like basically one angle of the base so let's check like maybe we can like can like this we can move here to preventing this what we do maybe like this maybe it's more useful how to say it but like this is easy to snipe after they snipe it they can still frame finger so we also have to make it like, like a, a little bit harder so what we do we can put like more inside make more inside and like this okay buddha hat the king is nice here because i pretty sure people like why I, I explain like why I like the king in this position. Because if I dragon spam here and and maybe slammer here. Red is my slammer. Red basically is my slammer. The dragons will do on this way. Will follow maybe the king and go wrong. Maybe everything go, goes on the town hall and die here so so the the king i very like this position 
Another thing we can see is is this. Pretty sure this scatter, this scatter is weak. It's very weak, this scatter. So we have to find a way to protect this scatter shot. What we can do to protect this scatter shot? Okay, this two Tesla is neither here. We can maybe like this ground is one we can remove. Okay, we can make it like a little bit more heavy here with some Teslas. Teslas here, a Buddha hut here is nice. Giant. Okay. Basically like this. Okay. Where we can put like the rest of the trash. Mm, we can put. Okay, this. We can move one time up and down. I always prefer like the trash full map size. Okay. Last Buddha hut. Let's see where we can put it. This one we try to not give a chain. Okay. Last Buddha hut. The black bomb. One time maybe more in nap. The Buddha hut here is nice. One and for sure another here. Okay. We have three extra walls. We can add one here and add one here and close here. Basically, this is the base. This base is, is look at it like very nice already. It doesn't require like so many fix. Okay, maybe this here, this here. Yeah, since we did like. Free anti free base last base I think like is good if we do like a, a symmetrical one. So we we fix it like every type so people can see it, right? Okay, on this base, first thing we can see it. This base have too many uh, flame finger value. Example one here, very big flame finger value. Scatter shot here, another value and town hall. Like for corner, we need to fix like those flame finger first because flame finger now is meta. What we do for fix the flame finger here? Okay, maybe we can do like some nice bait on the town hall against the flame finger. So we remove here to let people maybe flame finger here. But I don't want them to do on, on the eagle. So we put the mortars maybe here is better. Put the cannon here to make it like a little bit harder to snipe. Okay, basically two step we fixed it. <laughs> Was very simple. Sure. Okay, let's see. I explain one thing, okay? Basically, flame finger, we have the mortar here. It covers this compartment. Flame finger will never come from here because we have the ground bow. We shoot every flame finger in this range. We need cover this side because there's no X bow protection. So we remove this and remove this because it's asymmetrical. We put the mortar here, okay? One time more in down, of course. Okay.
Okay, basically we fixed it. Another thing, I think these two walls is, is wasted. So we can basically remove it. Another thing we can see we can, another thing I like is close this compartment. I don't like like this compartment open it because I think it's it's easier for the queen charge or 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 many stuffs. So we try to save walls like always. Where we can take like other two walls. Maybe maybe we can make we can make it smaller here to try to save some walls. Okay, like this. So on these kind of bases, what we tend to see a lot is the use of a log launcher. Kind of like over from nine o'clock, you'd be able to pick up a lot yeah, of value. Yeah, yeah. Is there any way of, of um, kind of baiting or trying to defend against that potential of use course, of a log launcher? Of course. Okay, like this base now is very popular because for for fix one attack, I think you you need to know how how an attack works, right? So for for defend the frame finger, okay, we need to know like. Maybe uh, the log launcher, sorry, will come on this way because it's very common this type because the log basically can take like one multi, two multi. Snipe this multi without any spells. I say any spells. How to defend this? Maybe we can just like word and work here and spam and, uh, and the log here. For defend this, we need like put the... One one thing is maybe we can open the channels. So I don't know if if you are doing bowler smash, if you are doing like like I don't know queen charge, is 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 split. Make your hero split go far from the from the log launcher. Then put maybe a Tesla farm, the giant bomb, maybe a tornado. You know, the tornado sometimes can change. Like I mean, like the log launcher. It it can it can it can like it slow down or even change the position. Maybe I'm dropping maybe the, the log launcher is going here. But the tornado will, will spin the log launcher in this position. We will change the will change the position. After the log maybe is doing it like this, maybe it will go like this and won't shoot the, the multi or the this this away. But I think the log launcher on this base, if you do with bowlers is not nice because as I say, like this two channel is 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 good against the bowlers because we split just. Okay, like this, we basically fixed like the flame finger on the two scatter shot. The eagle is nice now. Town hall we left without the protection, but we can make like a good bait. Like this. You put in the Tesla here to slow down the flame figure so they have to use like maybe loons and skeleton here hero I think like this is is better okay let's look again the traps once again dragons I think we'll come on the scatter shot. So where we had the Nando, with the Nando we have like here. We can bait the dragons from here. Nando. Maybe some black bomb here is nice. One here, one here. The the red bomb is already here, so it's okay. I like the spring traps here. One here. The giant bomb I think is better if we split it. One here, one here. And 
here. The two words, we close this, so it is better. We open this. Something like this, I like it. The two extra words here. We need to close also this compartment. Let's, let's check where we have like extra defense. We can put like a cannon here, archer tower here, and we have like a cannon here, so both sides is, is the same. We check where we have the builder hut, so we can put the builder hut there, the six builder hut. Okay, basically, it's done. Let's put the rest of the traps now. We can put like here. Okay. I think like this more deep is better. And yeah, that's a rough arm against the flinger. Here is nice. And we put like the rest of the spring traps. Okay, we also done this base. Thank you so much for coming on, man. Honestly, we didn't we didn't manage to get through all those bases, but the bases you did some awesome changes to. I know nearly everyone that you reviewed their bases were in the chat, and they were all absolutely loving the stuff you were doing. A few of the bases there, you actually didn't make too many changes, which I think is uh, giving a few of those builders some nice confidence in the fact that you kind of approved of their bases. Um, but yeah, thanks so much for coming on, man. Always a pleasure yeah. to have you. You, you did uh, some awesome work. It's my there. pleasure. Sweet.